can't see whether it's showing on the camera or not. Oh, I love a frothy coffee. everybody and welcome to my house my name is Nigel Hay and this is Nigel's Cheap Vlogs and today we're doing something completely different we're doing a vlog which is based on people's beliefs okay the plan is we're going to do an experiment and this all stems from a Facebook conversation between a couple of my friends in fact a few of my friends who got themselves into a bit of an argument and it all centers around the conspiracy of a flat earth so we're not going to directly get into flat earth so let's just stop that right there but one of the conversations went on the lines of something about curving water and they're trying to prove how the water cannot curve well simple science says it can so what i'm going to do right right today on this video is demonstrate very clearly that water can bend but how am i going to do it well, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you after I've had a frothy coffee. Mm. I did a little test earlier on and it worked. So I thought, you know what? This will make a damn good vlog. All right, so what is the logic behind this video I'm doing? Well, just the other day, I posted on Facebook a post regarding a cruise ship, which is taking a load of flat earthers on a cruise. And the headline basically was, just don't tell any of the flat earthers. The navigation system is based on a spherical planet. So how are they all gonna make out? So this opened a massive debate, as you can imagine, on Facebook uh, with people Mainly one, just mainly one. But you know what, it got a bit heated, I stayed out of it. But uh, one of the challenges was, let's prove it. As a ball, you gotta try and prove something. So I've come up with this very unique schoolboy scientific experiment, which, hey, I was a schoolboy nearly 40 years ago. So uh, I vaguely remember it, so we're gonna do it right here on the internet, on YouTube, to prove that water can curve. Okay, so here we go. I got my little setup here. I got my uh, camera, which is a, a Canon, and we're gonna record it in um, 120 frames uh, per second, uh, which means we, it will be slow motion, very good slow motion, so we can capture the full image of what I'm actually gonna try and do. For this experiment, we're gonna try three different things, and we're gonna fill them up with water. The first one will be just your standard pint glass, all right? See through, yeah, yeah, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna use that. Then I'm gonna use the lid of my thermos, okay? We're gonna place that. And then we're gonna try something completely different. Just a square dish. We're gonna fill it with water and we're gonna see whether we can see the curve on all three of these. Can we get another drop in? Okay, that's the first one done, so we're now gonna move on to the next second thing, and we're now gonna use the thermos lid. Uh, this one is not see-through in any way, so it'll be different with the light, I hope. Uh, it's still round, so uh, let's see how this one does. Look at that, centered. So this is our next one, okay? Okay, we're now gonna put water in here, and see whether we can get a curve on this one. 
Simple science. Simple science, folks. Oh, it's full. It's full. This is just a square plastic thing. So we'll use this to fill it up with water and see what results we get from this. Seriously don't know why I do this because you just can't argue with these people. You can't make them see right or wrong. It's their way or the highway basically. But you know what? I'm having a bit of fun doing this. So uh, will this one work as well? This is the third test and we're gonna see if it works. Let's go. Oh yeah, we're in. What do you think of that little experiment? Uh, was you blown away? Did you not know you could actually do that? Did you not know yourself that water could curve? Because I'll tell you what, a lot of people didn't know that. Bottom line is, I am not a flat earther. I am definitely a round baller and I'm happy to be a baller. I believe what I've been told in the past. I have seen with my own eyes the curvature of the earth. Being at an aircraft in the cockpit at 40,000 feet, I have seen it and I believe what I see, and all the scientific experiments we've been told about as children and growing up all lead to the fact that it does prove we live on a spherical globe. We do, but if you don't want to comprehend that or you can't, well, that's your choice. But please stop, stop turning this into a cult as though you have to make sure we listen to what you're saying because it just does not make sense. Okay, that is it for this particular vlog. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch it all. Um, please make sure you put some comments below if you liked it, what you thought. But if you get into a discussion with someone, please keep it respectful. Uh, I really would appreciate that. And same with me, if you've got any comments for me, keep them respectful as well, the best you can. All right, um, please make sure you like, subscribe, and uh, we'll be back very, very soon with, with uh, some more vlogs here on Nigel's Cheap Vlogs. Thank you.